After his controversial default at the Dubai Championships, Andre Rublev has come out and spoken about what has happened, or at least his reaction to what happened after a few days of maybe cooling down and trying to understand what's been going on. He also has been reinstated with his ranking points, which we've also found out through the ATP. We'll talk about that as well. Let's go have a look at what Andre had to say over on Twitter. So this was his response over on Twitter. I want to thank the appeal committee for approving my appeal and changing course on the ATP's initial decision of disqualifying me from the Dubai semi-final and taking away the ranking points and prize money I earned last week. I hope that in the future, the ATP will take a closer look at this rule and make changes to it so that an official can't force a match outcome without having clear evidence and not letting the player have a video review. While I was disappointed I wasn't able to finish my semi-final in Dubai, I'm grateful for all the support I had from you the last two days. I received a lot of messages. Thank you to everyone supporting me. I promise I will learn from this and will try to be a better player and better person. So the ATP have actually come out with a statement as well regarding the issue. And they've said, the appeals committee concluded that beyond forfeiting the match, customary penalties associated with a default, namely loss of ranking points and prize money for the entire tournament, would be disproportionate in this case. So there you go. That is where we're at. And I don't know, it seems a little bit strange that we kind of got to this point because it didn't feel like maybe it was warranted as a default. Maybe it shouldn't have been a default because he didn't get any penalty. The only penalty was that he lost the match and has that default next to his name for the rest of his career, which is a little bit of a shame, but let me know down in the comments below. What do you think of the whole situation now that we're a couple of days removed? Heat of the moment, maybe we all had certain opinions at the time, but a couple of days later, how are you guys feeling about this situation? And do you think it's fair that Rublev was able to get all his points back, was able to get that prize money back, or do you think that they should have Maybe not giving him any of that so to, you know, to learn a lesson or something like that. But uh, there it is, Rublev, getting all his points back, getting the prize money back, but the default is still going to stick.